Welcome back, folks. Today, we have an exciting topic to discuss that can help you take charge of your finances and build a secure future. We're diving into the fascinating realm of psychology and its application to saving money. That's right. We're going to explore how understanding human behavior can empower us to save more effectively. So grab a pen and paper, because we're about to unlock the secrets to saving money using psychology. Before we dive in, let's quickly understand why psychology plays such a crucial role in our financial decisions. You see, our brains are wired in intricate ways, and sometimes these wires can lead us astray when it comes to money matters. But fear not, because psychology helps us make sense of it all. First up, goal setting and visualization. Psychology tells us that setting clear, specific, and time-bound goals increases the chances of success. So when it comes to saving money, it's essential to have both short-term and long-term goals in mind. Visualize those goals, create a vision board, or write them down somewhere you can see them daily. This practice enhances motivation and commitment. Next, let's explore the fascinating field of behavioral economics. It examines how our cognitive biases and decision-making processes influence our financial choices. One important concept is the anchoring effect, which suggests that we tend to rely heavily on the first piece of information we encounter when making decisions. Be aware of this bias and resist external influences that may lead you to overspend. Delayed gratification is another powerful psychological principle we can use to save money. It's the ability to resist immediate temptations for long-term benefits. By practicing delayed gratification, we can save more effectively. Instead of buying something on impulse, take a moment to consider the long-term value of that purchase. If it's not essential, redirect those funds toward your savings. Now, let's bring in the practice of mindfulness. Mindful spending and budgeting can transform your relationship with money. Mindfulness involves being fully present and aware of your financial behaviors without judgment. By practicing mindful decision-making, you can ask yourself if the purchase aligns with your financial goals and values before making it. Our social environment greatly influences our spending habits. We tend to conform to the norms of our social groups. So, why not leverage this to our advantage? Surround yourself with friends who prioritize saving and share your financial aspirations. Creating a supportive network or joining financial communities provides encouragement and accountability. In this digital age, automation can be our best friend. Automating savings is a powerful strategy to overcome self-control issues. Set up automatic transfers from your checking account to a savings account. This ensures consistent contributions without requiring constant decision-making. And let's make it even more exciting by adding a touch of gamification to the process. By applying psychological principles to our saving habits, we can take control of our financial futures. Setting SM art goals, understanding decision-making biases, practicing mindful spending, leveraging social norms, automating savings, and adding a dash of gamification to the mix. These strategies can make a significant difference. Remember, saving money is not just about accumulating wealth. It's about cultivating a healthy and empowered mindset towards our financial well-being. So, go forth armed with these psychological insights and start your journey toward financial freedom. That's all for today, folks. Thanks for joining us on this exciting exploration of psychology and saving money. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell to stay tuned for more valuable content. Until next time, happy saving.